I would like to use this sunset photograph to demonstrate the power of the basic development module in Lightroom. The first thing I want to do, do is hit the F key to go into full frame mode. And this, this photograph was taken with a Nikon D800, which has a very wide dynamic range. It's a perfect camera to demonstrate the uh, power of being able to manipulate light levels in a raw frame. The overall exposure of this photograph actually isn't too bad. Now the highlights are very washed out and the foreground lacks a lot of detail. And the way to bring that in isn't to actually change the overall exposure itself or the contrast. The first thing to do is just bring the highlight slider way back. Now as you do that, you'll notice that you get a lot of detail right here in the, in the band that was washed out previously that's the, actually the area of the setting sun. And to bring detail in this dark foreground area, you just bring the shadows up a little bit. About, say, let's go about right, right there. Now, you don't really need to change the whites or the blacks yet because there's good dark areas in this. And the next thing I want to do is actually increase the clarity. Now you ask, why am I doing that? Is because this looks relatively featureless, even though we did increase the light levels. The clouds do have a lot of detail in them, and the clarity slider ought to bring a lot more detail out in those clouds. So let's just jack that way up, almost overdo it for a moment. And actually that looks pretty good. And then I want to bring the vibrance up just some to bring some detail in there. Now, looking at this photograph, it already looks a lot better, but it seems to me to have too much blue in the sky because this foreground area right here actually looks very bluish. So let's take the, go up to the temperature balance, or the color balance, the temperature area, and just add a lot of yellow to that. Now that to me looks quite a bit better and it looks a lot warmer. This looks like actual sand that it was. This band right here looks a little bit warmer. It did take some of the blue out of the sky, but overall that looks pretty good. I think we can add a little bit more shadow detail in here and about right there and maybe just a fraction. Don't overdo the clarity too much, but it looks pretty good. and. All we've done is brought the highlights back down, increased the shadows to bring detail into the foreground right here, and then we've increased the clarity and the vibrance. Now, to show you what that looks like before and after, let's dim the interface a little bit by hitting the L key. This is the after photograph. There's the before photograph, totally unmodified. And there's what we accomplished with just the simple um, few sliders in the basic panel.